Hey guys, welcome back to my channel in my tutorials. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you advanced transformation techniques in BI. So if you look at the sheet that I have over here, this data is completely unorganized. It is not in a way where in we can work with the data in BI. So obviously we will have to transform this particular data. For example, I want these two rows here need to be or these three rows here need to be transposed into three different columns and then all the values here needs to be aligned with those columns so i'm going to teach you how to do this so let's jump to power bi so i have already imported the data over here i didn't want to waste time by importing the data again from excel so this is what i have over here this is how it is looking in bi and if you see here there is no column name over here there's no column name here and uh, and then you will see here if we scroll down below you will see that we have year we have actual versus forecast and then we have periods over here so this is what we will have to transform so the first thing we will do is let's head to edit query this is where all the magic happens in bi and so if you can see here now we've got those three rows here on top so the first thing that we will do here is let's head to the transform tab and let's click on transpose so we will see what will happen so the moment you click on transpose you will see that all the rows have now turned into columns so we have year we have whether it's actual or forecast and then we have period now you might be happy that we are sorted but no wait so if you look at the next columns over here what has happened is what we had in our columns have now gone back into rows and we now have to fix them as well so if you look at the data here, we've got the columns back into the rows. So now what we need to do is let us merge these three columns first. OK, so we'll go back to the transform tab and click on merge columns. And once you click on that, you will get a separator here. I'm going to select colon for now. You can choose whatever that you would want to. And then I'm going to click on OK. So all those three columns will get merged into one now what we will do is we will click on transpose once again so that we get back the two columns that we had over here and then go to the home tab and click on use first row as headers we will elevate our first row to the headers so we will do that so once that is done now what we will do is we will go back to the transform tab select the first two columns over here and then right click and say unpivot other columns it's okay so the moment you do that you will see that everything is trying to fall in place over here we have a column here which had these numbers over here we had the description of these numbers over here and then we have the merged columns all into one single column here three different columns in one single column and then we have all the values here aligned in one particular column. Now what we need to do is we need to split this. So on the transform tab, I'm going to click on split column by delimiter. Colon was our delimiter here. And then each occurrence of the delimiter, I'm going to click on OK. So you will see that we've now created three different columns. So we'll right click this column here and let's call this as department. And we'll call this as department name and likewise you can rename the other columns as well we'll quickly do that okay so as you can see here we've now renamed all the columns that we had we have department here department name we have year we have forecast period value etc everything aligned in the way bi understands and where you can actually play around with the data however you would want to so this is how you can transform the unorganized data into organized data using the power query within power bi so i hope this video has helped you you've learned something new today please consider subscribing to my channel for more such tutorials